we're on a, a known Roman site this morning. There's some, absolutely some beautiful finds come off here. Brooches, coins, all sorts. Uh, but the stubble is still a bit high. We're going to give it a go. And I bought my three inch head and see what happens with that. But I think it's going to be hard work. But we know for a fact there's Roman on here. So as uh, soon as it's all fine, I'll catch you again in a bit, whatever. Danny just had an orgasm. Thought he found a Saxon. Nice red token that is Danny. Yeah, pretty nice But I only find nice tokens but don't Yeah, it's blank the one side. Yeah, I didn't want it. I didn't want anything. Yeah, I was going to say that when I find a token, I usually mark both sides. Yeah, I do too. But... It's nice, eh? Yeah. It'll do anyway. Fucking hard to His first signal was that medieval token. I've just had my first. Just had my first blank disc now. I don't bother with blank discs. <laughs> Go on, enjoy it while you can. Nah, it's gone, ain't it? Mm. Oh well, on to the next. This double's pretty high, so we restricted to digging in the tracks. And it looks like Danny's got a silver now. It's got to be Roman aid. Well, it looks like that mm. Oh, Roman Oh yes. Yeah. Oh yes. Yeah. I think so. It's a four-four. Have a look. Man. Oh yeah, I can see it. Even I can see it now, don't I? Fucker. Okay. Sorry. Beautiful that is. Let me have a look at the screen. Oh, nice, yeah. isn't he? Yeah. Roman coin, probably lost by a Roman soldier with a sword on his side, man. First person to touch it for nearly well, 16 to 2,000 years. It's beautiful, that is. That is a really nice coin, Dan. I mean, I've got some nicer, but this is a nice coin. Better than yours? Oh, better than a couple of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we'll have a good look at it and we'll have a break. It's beautiful, oh, that is. Good. Yep, so it's all about. Wow. Back again. We've had a couple hours on this field, but it's bloody hard work. Danny's had that beautiful coin. And we're just going to move on now to another field where Saxons come off, so. It's all right round here. It's some good fields. So we'll get there and I'll uh, get back to you if you find anything. Danny's at it again. God, that's delicate, ain't that? Hmm? Very delicate. Hmm. Only fine delicate things. Oh, shut up. Bring <laughs> this folks, let me this song. Nice sort of thing. A crafty, anyway, wasn't it? Looks like I've got part of a crow to belly on. Yeah. Broken. Good sign now. Okay, on to the next. Looks like we found a little productive area there. There's all sorts of bits and dabs. Nice little cross there. Ah, be alright when it's cleaned up. Okay, on to the next. Thought this was some type of brooch at first, but I don't think it is. No, some kind of hook. That's where the thread would have been in the end, I suppose. Never mind. Could have been. On to the next. Tiny minute things we find in here. It just reeks of Saxon to me for some reason. It's tiny. Anyway, on to the next. Another unusually decorated piece there. It's like a cross and a ball on it. Who know more when I clean it up. Some interesting little bits coming out from around here. Okey doke. 
on to the next. Just pulled out a clod of earth, about eight inches down. I don't know what that is. It's a spindle whirl or whatever. Another close look later anyway. Catch you in a bit. Mark's just had a nice little coin here. To William, I don't know. 1725. Nice little find. Be nice cleaned up. Okay, on to the next. It's like a musky boat. Yep. Musky boat. Took a clout on summit. What's the next? Got something here that looks coinish. Oh no. Might be the bottom of a sail. Not the best look on a clay wheel. Okay, on to the next one later. I'm going to do a round up now, Danny's finds. So, I'll see you in a bit. Yeah, you have enough film, Danny's finds at the end of a five hour search. First find, well not first find, but found an effigy of himself. Lead. Medieval pig goes back. Mm, and you are. I'm interested in bits and pieces. Well, not very interesting, but maybe a strap in when it's cleaned up. Two clad coins. Corn seal. I don't bother with these no more. Do. Got the shapes. And another Roman coin, he reckons. I think it's a squash musket ball actually. And it's a clad. And he's got his. So that's 15th century, yeah? I reckon. Well, I've set my machine up for 14th century. Oh, I don't know, that was 14th then. Right. <laughs> and the find of the day. Beautiful Roman coin. Where have I got the shakes? It's been knackered. Mm. Very nice. Right, let's have a look at Mark's. Right, Mark's clad. Mini accent, pendulum, whatever. Buttons. Musket ball. Button. Vicky. Half pence. Eighteen sixty 
another Vicky Orpence, I think. Nineteen sixty-two. Nineteen sixty. Oh, that one's eighteen eighty-two. And this one. I have to look up see what it is. Seventeen twenty-five. That is eh? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. No mark signs for that. Uh, I'm going to clean mine up and you'll see mine on the YouTube. <laughs>